Crab Boy Mill. We're going to be doing this basement floor. This is Rick with Custom Concrete Design. And we've got a lot of uh, cracks that have to be repaired. You can see this one runs the full length of this room. There's going to be some carpet glue that has to come up. A bunch of little carpet holes where the tack strips were. A lot of carpet glue there. Just crack just runs this whole front end. Of the, the whole downstairs basement. More carpet glue here. Kicked on pretty good there. Not too bad through here. Well, there's quite a bit in there. And that little closet. Some carpet fuzz here that needs to come up. Glue underneath of it, I'm sure. We're going to stop here in this doorway. We're not going to go inside that door, so I'm just going to go on the other side of those tack strip holes. There's another crack that goes from uh, south to north, I guess. So we're just going to grind this whole thing down and repair these cracks. Get these holes uh, patched in and start our overlay. This basement floor project in Grab Boys Mill is now complete. Has the epoxy on it. It's going to be a lot of reflection from the light coming in. So it's going to appear probably a little bit lighter by the windows. And my camera kind of shows this a little bit on the greenish side from time to time. And then it goes back into kind of an orange-brown. It's really more of an orange-brown instead of a greenish-yellow. It does have some yellow in it. But it looks a little bit more like you're seeing it here. It's a little bit truer to the color. Got two coats of uh, acid stain on here. We used our chemstone umber color and a brown chemstone color. Turn the bathroom light on, but I know it's going to yellow it out as soon as you see it. It's just not the best lighting and doesn't work well with this camera for some reason. But I can assure you it looks like the rest of the floor. Same with this little closet in here. That's about true to the color there. Got a really nice kind of uh, lava look to it, I guess you could say. Just with the different texturing and coloring we did. It's got some really cool effects.
definitely has some goldish tone to it too. That's the umber color. Lots of shine, that's for sure. Looks good. This is Rick with Custom Concrete Design. If you guys are watching this on YouTube, if you would, please subscribe to my channel. That way you can see all my videos in the, in the future here. Thanks for watching. See you guys on the next video.